Hello and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be showing you how you can make your very own <clears throat> 20th Century Fox intro. You'll need Blender and the template files linked in the description below. If you click on the link, you'll get to this. You have to click on 20th Century Fox zip. So we're going to open the file. As you can see, it is zipped, so we're going to have to extract the files. Clicked on it. Click on Extract All. Extract. So, so there we go. So I'm going to be working with the 20th Century Fox searchlight. So pretty much, but I am going to open up all of these. This is the 2009 one, and the classic one, which is simply called 20th Century Fox Template. And 20th Century Fox Template 2. Now, it will say Ballywig Productions. Credit to Ballywig for his tutorials. If you want real better tutorials, go to his channel for more movie logos and better tutorials. This would be ideal if you want two lines on your thing. But the one we're going to be working on today is 20th Century Fox Searchlight, aka Fox Searchlight Pictures. So you're going to right click on Fox, press tab, backspace, and enter your desired text. So, as you can see, it's pretty big. So, you, you click on this thing, and so you can resize it. Like this. Well, I won't, well, the thing is, I won't be needing the top one. So, you're going to press X, and then delete. Same with these lines, if you don't need that. Right click on searchlight, press tab, backspace, and enter your text you want. As you can see, it's a little bit small, so we're going to have to resize it. Now, right click on pictures, just tab, backspace, and enter your desired text. It's a little bit big, so we're going to resize it. Now, I will not be needing the subtitle. So you're going to kind of go over here on this window, kind of right click as much as you can, press X, and then delete. Well, I won't need it. So yeah, this is pretty much going to be our intro. So wh what you're going to do, you're going to click on render. If you want an image, you're going to click on render image. If you want an animation, click on render animation. Now, the thing is, my computer um, isn't really meant for that stuff, but I do... There is another computer in the house that is capable of doing this. So you're going to click on render animation. And it might take a while depending on your computer. Um, and I'll see you guys um, in the next video. Goodbye.